What's up guys, it's me, your badass host Draven, and welcome to another episode of our Pokemon Platinum Walkthrough. Okay, so, we skipped ahead, uh, and got out of the spring and, uh, the distortion world and, you know, whatever. I don't know. Uh, yeah. If you guys may have remembered in the last episode, yeah, 40 god dang minutes long. Did a lot of talking right there, and now it is time to go to Sunny Shore City because, uh, yeah, we still got a badge to win. We still got one more badge to win, and of course, if you can't see, you know, the the the, the amount of time that we're gonna be doing here, yeah, it's a uh, damn near 25 minutes, or maybe just a little bit more. I don't even know. I really don't know. I did cut I did cut out like the first three minutes of this this actual uh, video right here because you know what, the other stuff not too important. What I did was. Yes, we got out of where we were, the spring something, and then after that we went to Professor Rowan. Of course, he tells me that he, uh, that the legendary Pokemon had come back, and, uh, they're okay. They're good for the pickings, or the taking, or whatever. And, uh, he's the one that actually referred us to go to the, uh, go to the gym right here, in Sunny Shore City. Now, if you guys can't remember, uh, Sunny Shore City is the location that we couldn't go to in the beginning because unfortunately there was a blackout and uh, I guess after the whole Giratina event you will you will be able to go in, into uh, Sunny Shore City now uh, but there are a buttload of trainers right here this is the reason why it's 25 minutes guys literally the reason why it's 25 minutes it's annoying it really is so we're gonna be doing a little bit of training I did uh, stock up on a, quite a few items uh, in our last episode, yes, uh, it was also proof that, uh, we were greatly underleveled because, what was his name, uh, Cyrus, he had his way with us, we had to use a bunch of max repel, or max revives, a lot of revives, potions, and all that stuff, yeah, I'm going to be doing a lot of training outside of this, this episode right here, because we need to get ready for the so, so, uh, Sunny Shore uh, City Gym, and then... You know, eventually the the Pokemon League, and as you can see, Hydra number four is grow has grown a level, and he is learning uh, Dragon Dance. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna I'm gonna take away uh, Dragon Rage and exchange it for Dragon Dance right here. And uh, well, let's see, what can we do? What should we do? Let's find out. Okay, well we just defeat this guy. He's a rich boy. I don't even know. And. Uh, well, let's see. We, we we just gotta we gotta switch out our Pokemon, you know. Uh, switch out Pokemon, uh, you know, heal them up, and then what else? What else is uh is there to do? Oh yes, uh, put the ex uh, the experience points onto another Pokemon right here because, you know, we need to train. We really do. We need to train. And uh, well, let's go ahead and switch them up right here to Gaia number two because. Oh boy, he needs a little bit of training, and look at that, we found three Wiki Berries. That's awesome. That's always great. Three Wiki Berries. It's always good. And then we got two Mago Berries. I, I don't know what Mago is, but we'll find out. We'll eventually see what's going on. And then here we go, two Aguav. Aguav Berries. Alrighty. And then what's next? Who's next? Right here? Two Quillot Berries. Hopefully it's not, like... Quaaludes and stuff, you know, drugs. Not that you need to know. It's just whatever. Anywho, talk to this lady right here, and she will be battling you. Oh yes. Now, while I'm now while I'm battling this uh, pretty uh, beautiful Nicola right here. Oh shit, low pony. This is crazy too. So anywho, while I'm talking to her, uh, while I'm battling her, I, I just need to talk to you guys about a little something that I've noticed over the weekend. I failed to tell you guys uh, what. Uh, these last three days, but here it is. Uh, apparently, YouTube had changed up their rules again, like always. And uh, while I was actually wa like while I was actually watching some of my walkthroughs, yeah, this is like a first time. I actually noticed that my comments were disabled, and it was due to the fact that uh, it was the kids only uh, restriction thing that they put in. I don't even know. It's some kind of new rule. Uh, if you guys know what I'm talking about, or for those who are YouTubers, comment down below. You guys, you guys know what it what it is. Uh, yeah, so that that's what happened. I, you know, I didn't even read the fine print on when they sent me that message, and I put, yeah, this is made for kids and whatnot. Didn't get to realize that. Oh well, uh, 
that meant that most of my videos were gonna be featured on like YouTube for kids and the comments down below were gonna be disabled until I switched the whole settings and all that stuff so that like if, if some of you guys were wondering why you couldn't comment on some of my older videos such as Pokemon Yellow, Crystal, Emerald, Stadium, you know, what, what, what have you. Uh, it's mainly because of that and I do apologize. Um, I did switch all the settings. I did come out with a video on Instagram about it. Uh, I, did, I, I, I did talk about it on Instagram on a little video. Uh, of course, if you guys if you guys notice this 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 whole thing, the walkthroughs, it's focused on whoever plays Pokemon walkthroughs. It doesn't matter what the age is. If your age is, you know, five through my age, twenty nine, then uh, you know, of course, you guys are gonna be watching these walkthroughs right here. And many of you guys already know that I do come out with a little bit of language that, that, that that's not suitable for all these kids and stuff. So. You know, that's why I put it to not uh, no no restrictions to kids because, you know, some of these kids might be hearing me cuss up a storm because uh, homie here gives me a crappy ATM, which is TM56, right? What was it? Yeah, it, fling. It's fling. Yeah, you see, you see what I mean? So, again, really, really sorry, guys. It's been taken care of, and uh, hopefully YouTube doesn't screw me over again, like always, because, you know, it's YouTube. I mean... Lots of restrictions and all that stuff. Anywho, uh, let's see, uh, crap, this guy, seriously, he turns around and, oh, God. And you wonder, and you wonder why it, uh, <laughs> yeah, and you wonder why, uh, this video is a little long, because homeboy here turns around and, oh, God, I hate you, I hate you. Okay, so, let's go ahead and destroy this Remoraid, because we can. Let's make him suffer. Let's go ahead and make him suffer. That's right, look at that. See that? Rem Raid defeated. Oh, yeah. Okay, and, uh, yeah, this should have been just one battle total. But this guy had to turn his back around, you a hole. Oh, God. So here we go, another battle, and this time it's going to be against uh, Sailor Mark with the C. And, uh, well. Coming out with a Mantic and yep, baby type Pokemon, baby Pokemon of uh, what was it called again? Uh, baby Pokemon of Mantine, and uh, I believe Mantic has a weird way of evolving. If it doesn't have what was it called uh, a Remoraid in its say in this in your party, then it won't evolve at a certain level. I think that's what the deal is. If I'm wrong, comment down below, guys. You guys already know that I, I do take your guys' critiques uh, pretty well. And then uh, let's see. Let's see. Okay, so that's pretty much it right there. Look at that. Oh, yes. Defeated you. Real easily. Okay, alrighty. So, who's next? Uh, there's a lot of stuff right here. And uh, let's... Okay, found ourselves a PP up, which is always good. And, uh... Let's see. Oh, well, there's a lot of trainers. Lots and lots of trainers. So, let's go ahead and switch out my Pokemon right here. And uh, let's try and get... Let's try and get some uh, some Gaia number two some experience right here. I want to be stronger, like nothing else. That's right. Okay. So he's coming out with a level 42 Magikarp, and again I'm like right here. Again I'm like right here wondering why. Like why would you train your magic up? Magikarp all the way up to level 42 when you could have evolved it into a Gyarados, you know, have a level 42 Gyarados. That's what I'm wondering. That really is what I'm wondering. I don't know, I, I just don't get... Yeah, like, I just don't get Pokemon sometimes. And look at that, he's coming out with a, a Gyarados. Is this... Yeah, level 45 Gyarados. You know, he could have had two Gyarados at level 40, but no! This guy's being an asshole. Yeah, of course, me being, uh, me, I'm gonna... Yeah, I'm gonna be, uh complaining about everything I think I don't even know <laughs> and there you go suck it Gyarados you see super effective quadruple the damage right there oh yeah and uh, well let's see that's level 43 toothless and uh, well that's pretty much it right there okay so let's go ahead and uh, talk to this guy please do not have a magic card because if you do I swear I swear to baby Arceus I will smack you upside the head and, uh, well, I'm about to smack this guy upside the head just because he has a Magikarp. Look at that. 
Oh my god. Oh my god, I can't believe you. Uh And then, uh... Well, Shockwave is going to do us very, very well. And, uh, look at that. Goodbye. Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay, so he's coming out with the Gyarados. Wow, I, I just don't get these people sometimes. I really do. I, I just don't get it. Uh, okay, so Gyarados intimidates us, and here we go with the Shockwave, and uh, let's see if this actually works. Just like last time. It will never miss. Quadruple damage. Come on! For the bitches. Ah, shit. Okay, never mind. And, uh, well, I couldn't be using my Gyarados, because uh, this Gyarados is using a Rain Dance, and, it, you know, Thunder won't fail in the rain. Come on. Let's do it. Let's do it. Finish him. Finish him! And that is how you do it. And that is how baby- wait, what? What? Oh god. You and your Hydro Pump, you a-hole Pokemon. Why would you do that to me? I don't even know. Oh god. So how are you guys doing out there? It's Thursday. Feeling pretty good. I don't know. It's Thursday. Hope you guys are having a great day. Me? I'm just doing this whole thing right here. Beating everybody. Now, let's see. It is, uh... It is January 23rd. Holy crud, this day, like, this year is going by too quickly, too. We are close to finishing up our Pokemon Platinum walkthrough. In fact, I actually re like recorded my episodes all the way to the end of uh, the, uh, the Elite Four. I don't know how many episodes... Yeah, I don't know how many episodes I, I'm going to have or I'm going to go... I'm going to make after the Elite Four because there's a... Remember, guys, there's a post-game and all that stuff. Hmm. Should probably do that. And yes, yes, guys. Uh, remember, there will be uh, what was it? Event Pokemon Two. I will have them in a separate, uh, well, a separate series right there, just like I did with Pokemon. Well, that I will do for Pokemon Emerald. And uh, oh shoot, Ice Beam. No, I hate you. Oh god. But yes, we're nearly we're we're nearly done, and I believe. By uh, February 1st, I will... Yeah, February 1st, I'm going to actually... I'm, I'm going to start doing uh, the, the episodes for Pokemon Black and White, which... Actually, I'm actually going to do Pokemon Black. So, I'm going to do that. That way we can, uh, you know, get the ball rolling. Get into Yanova. Get more glory. Dominate everything. Make 10 years of Draven pretty awesome. As you can see, Finneon right here, the fake... Uh, the fake evolution. <laughs> Literally thought this was an evolution. Evil evolution. I can't even say that shit right. <laughs> and uh, there we go. Alrighty. That's right. All right. And uh, oh crud. Finneon still survives. I can't believe you. Oh my god. And uh, well, he's still healing up right here. So. Let's go right ahead and uh, Mega Drain. Let's do that again. Come on! Oh, jeez. And that is how you defeat... Yes, that is how you defeat a freaking Finneon right there. And, uh, well... Okay, so that's uh, that's enough right there. Okay, so now we got to move on to the next Fisherman. There's like three Fishermen. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. I'm going to... Uh... I don't know which one's worse. This one, battling a bunch of fishermen with a bunch of Magikarps, or the Distortion World and all its confusing things. You guys already know that I wasn't really happy about that one right there. In fact, you know, actually, when I was actually doing these recordings, guys, this this was the section of the, of the whole walkthrough that I was actually dreading the most because it, it took a lot of time. Trust me, guys, I... I one day, one Tuesday, I had a day off from work, and I decided, hey, you know, let's go ahead and re-record the whole thing, and after I mashed them up together, and it, holy crud. So, the last, what, two, three episodes, maybe four, about close to two to three hours long of a of walkthrough video, so, huh, yeah, that's dedication right there for you guys. And, uh, oh, damn, defense is going down, and Finneon has been defeated. Oh yeah! That's right, Finion. He had no chance. Okay, and uh... Okay, so let's go ahead and uh, switch him up right here. Let's 
Let's go with Toothless. Let's see where Toothless is going. Let's go with Toothless. And, uh, well... Let's go with uh, Dragon Claw right here. And, uh, well, Phoebus. Phoebus not looking pretty awesome right there. It's like uh, the equivalent of uh, another Magikarp right there. And, uh, well, there we go. Defeated that guy. Who's next? This guy right here. Oh my god, how many fishermen aren't there? Oh god. Oh god. Okay, so here we go. Fisherman Cole coming out with the Gyarados. Okay, alrighty. So he's actually training his Magikarps. Now, if he did have a Feebas and were to evolve it, now this would be a, a, a useful person to actually battle against. You know, with the VS Seeker. And here we go. Psycho Cut. Look at that. Oh, yes. And, uh, oh, crud. Oh, crud. Oh, crud. Oh, crud. There's that Hydro Pump. And so, let's go again. Let's go with that Shockwave. See what we can do right here. Come on. Finish it off. Yes, buddy. Yes. Okay. And, uh, well... This, this Gyarados will not faint. Okay. And there goes Gaia number two, which I am not too happy about right now. Really not happy. So let's go ahead and, uh... Okay, who's the next guy? Let's go... Let's go with Hydra. <laughs> Excuse me. I just... I just, uh... Sneezed again. Oh, God. No, guys, I am not getting sick. I really am not getting sick. <laughs> so there we go. Thunder attack. And does it do it? Yes, it does. How about that? All right. Experience points. We're looking good. And here's he's coming out with another Gyarados. Alrighty, okay. So let's go ahead and do this. Um, switch him out, and we're gonna be going with the next one. Let's go with Starblade. And uh, why did I why did I change it to Starblade? I, I want to know that. Sometimes I, I wonder what my thought process is. I really do. And uh, okay, so let's see. Let's go ahead and uh, let's go with Takedown right here. It will work. Will it work? Oh my god. That's a nice amount right there. Okay. Alrighty. And uh, of course, it has Ice Fang, so we're gonna get we're gonna get in trouble for that one right there. So let's go ahead and do the fly. That way we don't get hurt. And uh... Okay. That's right, bring it. Just bring it. And uh... BAM! Fly attack. Does it do it? Nearly makes that guy faint. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. And then, uh, of course, it's a fight to the finish. It is a fight to the finish. Here we go. Aerial Ace for the win. Oh, yes. How about that? <laughs> oh, yeah. Okay. And, uh, well, we're going to be switching it up right here to another Pokemon because, of course, Remoraid is going to take advantage of the whole weakness and stuff. My Pokemon being all weak. Oh, God. Okay, so here we go. Come on, Remoraid. Bring it. I'd like to see you do something. And there we go. Oh, yes. Mega Drain. Take it away. Take it away. Come on. All the way. Yes. Remoraid has been defeated. I'm happy about that. I really am. So many trainers, I swear to God, it's so many trainers, and uh, well, that is uh, that, that is pretty much it right there. So let's go ahead and revive our Pokemon and and do everything else right here because uh, we still got a lot of stuff to do right here. Uh, let's see, 19 minutes already. We still got a few minutes to talk about other stuff like uh, you know what? Screw you and screw you. I hate you and I really do hate you, and. Uh, Okay, so let's see, uh, Starblade's healed up, everybody's healed up, that's good, and, uh, talk to this kid, and he does want, he wants us to see the Pokemon that he has, which is always good. Good game, good stuff. Alrighty, so, let's go ahead, and it's Tuber Holly against me, Gaia 2. Alright, let's go Gaia, let's do this. Shockwave, alrighty. Alrighty, and look at that shockwave takes him all the way down. That's right, Remoraid. You can't defeat guy at number two. Oh, well, a lot of people is defeated guy at number two, but you know what I mean, right? 
And there we go. Tuber Holly, you needed to capture a little bit more than just one Pokemon. That's right. I said it. What you gonna do about it? <laughs> okay, so let's move on right here and... Oh, God. Okay, so he's not a fisherman that's gonna battle me and he's talking to me about the record of Pokemon and inches and all that stuff. Now, if you go inside right here, uh, this guy, he loves his Pikachu and he says he's gonna defeat Pokemon with only P... Or he's gonna defeat the whole thing with a Pikachu. I would like to see that happen. And if you talk to this guy, uh... Yeah, he wants to see you capture the biggest Remoraid ever. If you do capture the biggest Remoraid ever, I believe he gives you some kind of nice gift. Comment down below, guys. Still don't have the books. You know, that kind of stuff. And, uh, let's see. I think you can capture Electabuzz right here. Now, you can find a tiny mushroom right here. And then, uh... Let's see. I'm just gonna... Well, I'm just gonna use a Max Repel, because I really don't want to get attacked by any Pokemon. And, uh... There we go, we find ourselves a full restore. And we find ourselves a quick ball. I think there's one more item right here. Uh, maybe, I don't even know. And uh, let's see, I'm gonna surf right here because there's an actual open spot right here and uh, nothing right here. And yes, we find ourselves a big mushroom, which is always good too. I think you can sell that. And uh, alrighty, so that's enough of that. And, uh, let's see. I'm gonna go right here. Oh, shit. We need to battle that guy. Okay. Alrighty. Switching out our Pokemon, and, uh, let's go. Let's do this. My dream. He has dreams of capturing every Pokemon in the world, I guess. I don't even know. Alrighty. So, here we go. Sailor Luther coming out, and, uh, he's coming out with his, uh, Wingle. Okay. Alright, Wingle. Bring it. Uh, let's go with a crunch, and, uh, well, of course, he's gonna be faster than me. Oh, God, come on. There we go. Crunch time. It's crunch time, and there it is. He has been defeated. Okay, okay. And, uh, let's see, let's see. More experience points right there. And he's gonna be coming out with a Gastrodon, which is kind of new right here. Is it... Oh, no, it's the other region's Gastrodon, but this is a very... Very strong Pokemon when you think about defense and all that stuff. It is slow, just like uh, like Donatello right here, but you know, it's still something, you know, it's still something. And uh, as you can see, Mega Drain nearly does the job. God dang it. Oh man. Well, it's almost like I want to beat these guys one hit KO every single time, but it's never going to happen. Not right now. Not at this, not, not at this pace right here. And uh, alrighty. Okay, look at that. Oh, yes. And, uh, well, that's another Gastrodon down. I'm happy. And, uh, Donatello's getting points. Toothless, too, because he's awesome. And, uh, well, let's see. Coming out with a Machoke, I got a Pokemon for you. Let's go with this guy right here. Gaia number two. Let's go. Alrighty. So, who's next? Who is next? Machoke. Thinking he's awesome right here. When really he's not. So there we go. Psychic attack. Does it? Will it do it? Yes, it does. One hit KO. Oh, yes. Happy. Very, very happy. And, uh... Okay. And, uh... Is that it? Yes, it is. Sailor Luther, you have lost. And I... Yeah, I have... I have buried your dream. Buried your dream and all that stuff. Okay, so... I think that's pretty much it for all the trainers. Yes, it is all, that's all for the trainers right there. Okay, so, let's see, if you talk to this guy, yes, uh, Shockley Electric, yeah, he's giving us a f little foreshadowing of the gym battle, and then uh, this guy's talking to us about Volkner, the gym leader, he's saying that, you know, he's been a little bored as of lately. Now, once you come into C uh, Sunny Shore City, uh, homeboy right here with the big ol' afro is telling us about, you know, the Pokemon League, he is part of the Pokemon League, his name is Flint, and he's like, maybe you can just pull it off. You can turn this gym leader's uh, mood all around. He's been bored. So maybe this would be a good chance for you to renovate his spirits and all that stuff. So we're going to have to look for him. Flint, I hate you. Go away. So we're finally here, guys. Sunny Shore City. And, uh, yeah, we're going to be battling for the next badge in a few episodes, I think. So stay tuned, guys. I'll be back for another episode of Pokemon Platinum. See you guys.